In this video, we're looking at how to find a good voice artist and where to find them. This video is brought to you by EpiPies Academy. My first choice when it comes to finding a voice artist is Fiverr.com. We'll jump onto Fiverr now and I'll show you how to find a great voice artist at a great price and how to save time. And really this is about saving time because you can spend such a lot of time asking questions and then getting a prize and then you find out there's some extras. I'll show you how to fast track this. I'm going to search for female voice artist and I want them to be speaking British. So I'm going to search. That's going to give me a number of results and we'll see how many results it gives me on the left hand side here. So it says here we've got 72 results. Well, looking down here, there's some of these aren't female, so obviously it's given me some bogus results. What I'm going to do, and this is what I usually do, is I go over to the relevance button here. I just click down and get newest arrivals. This is going to give me a smaller amount of choices. In fact, it's given me five. They all fall under the keywords female voice artist British. And I also know that they're the newest arrivals. What this means is that I'm going to get the best price. Well, Fiverr sometimes throws up some level one sellers in this category. And as you can see from the price, $55, that's not a great starting price. This is a great starting price, $3, sorry, £3.69, which is $5. And let's have a look below. And we've got a £7, so that's about $10. One of the main criteria I look for is that they have a video, which means they've got some recordings, some samples. This one here, there's no samples. I won't even look at that. This one's too expensive. So we'll look at this one first and I'll have a listen. So click on the actual play button and it won't take you anywhere else. It'll just play a sample. I wasn't that impressed. It sounded a bit flat and it sounded low energy. Let's have a listen to another. As a promising writer, is your life busy? Do you feel overwhelmed with the number of things you... That sounds a lot more prof professional. So what I'll do next is I will actually click on their profile on the hyperlink here. I'll go to their project page and it tells me here that for you know £7.38 or $10 I'm getting up to 125 words, which is which is cool. That's a good price. Now, what I want you to do is go straight past about this gig, straight down here into the order details and the extras. This is an important area that you need to be looking at. You can see here that this person offers commercial rights at £18.46 and also full broadcast rights at £18.46. So there's quite a few extras that this person's adding on. The chances are you're going to be adding on your own background music and you'd expect to get a revision. You know, you're getting two revisions on this gig, which is important because if there's any mistakes or anything's not, you know, not delivered correctly, you'll, you'll want to ask for a revision. They do the job in three days, that's cool. Now what I'd do next is I would take my Word document, which has the script. So the Word document that you've created with your script that you've learned in this course, I would take that document, I would make sure that I've done a Word count and I've put the Word count at the very bottom of that script, which communicates to this Fiverr seller that you know what you're doing. They're going to see that it's a professionally written script. They're going to see that you've put a word count on there as well. 
which makes life a lot easier for them. And what I want you to do is I want you to contact them. So I want you to actually click here and I want you to send them as an attachment, the Word document that you've created and keep it brief. Just send them a message in here that says, hi Marina, use the person's name. Please have a look at the attached script and let me have your best complete price. By doing that, this individual will look at your script, they'll decide on a price, and the chances are they'll send you a custom offer, which is fine, you don't have to accept that custom offer. What it means is that you're cutting down the amount of communication time by a huge amount. Now imagine if you'd sent a message to this person and say, could you tell me how much for 125 words? Well, they already have that on their gig. What you're fishing for is what are the extras? But if you actually send a message to this person and say, here's my script, please let me have your best price. You'd like to think that they would be professional enough to send you a custom offer. And it might be that they haven't got a lot of work on at the moment. Bearing in mind, this is a new arrival. It's not a long-term fiver gigster. It's a new arrival. So this person's going to be keen. They're going to be excited that they've got a message. So if they send you a custom offer, the chances are that that custom offer is going to be quite low. I would do this with two or three suppliers. In this case, there wasn't two or three people who I would choose. But with other genres, I mean, British female vocal artists, there aren't that many on Fiverr. If it was an American voice artist and it was female or male, there would be hundreds. So choose the ones that have got a video, have a listen, see if their voice style and their delivery style is just right for your script, and then do what I did on this one. Go down past the description, have a look at what the extras are, have a look, see if they've got any reviews yet. Reviews don't mean everything. Some people might have two or three reviews. Some people might not have any yet, but that doesn't really matter. What you're interested in is getting the best price. Don't forget, with Fiverr, if you're not happy with what you've got, then you can ask to cancel the order. So this person knows that there's, there's an accountability there with the quality. Using this process, you will save a lot of time. There's nothing worse than going backwards and forwards, asking questions. You're getting straight to the point. Hi, here's my word document. This has got my script in. This is the word count. Please let me have your best price. It's very direct, very specific. And the chances are that person will come back to you with a custom offer and once that custom offer is sent to you, if you accept it, they can't come back and start asking for more. When they see your script, they'll realize exactly what the script is for and they'll send you a custom offer. 99 times out of 100, it will work out perfect. That's my advice. In the resources section underneath this video, I've actually listed some of the presenters, on-screen presenters and voice artists that I've used over the last five years. They come highly recommended. Some of them might not be the cheapest. I guarantee they are the best and I've used them numerous times. But if you're looking for a budget, a budget voiceover, then use this method that I've given you in this video and you will save a lot of money and you'll get the very, very best voiceovers and begin a relationship with a great voiceover artist on Fiverr.